What is up, everypony? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at Rainbow Apocalypse. This is an MLP horror alternative universe that we're going to be taking a look at today. And I'm not going to mind the bio of this person saying, by the way, my spelling and grammar is shit. Hopefully we'll be able to look past that with absolutely no issues whatsoever. But before I jump into the AU, I would like to shout out a good friend of mine. This is Appletail. Appletail is pretty damn cool, and I've even made a video about them before. They do a lot of art streams, and they make art in general, and they're one of the most chaotically fun people I have talked to in a long time. So make sure to check out Appletail in the description below, and make sure to say James sent ya. Anyway, moving on. Let's get started with this. We're going to read the uh, pin video at the very end, which I believe is a warning video that explains some information, but we shall see. So anyway, let's jump right in in three, two, one. Not gonna be playing any music, mainly because TikTok auto scroll is garbage. Rainbow Dash, are you sure this is what you want me to do? Scootaloo, yeah, yeah, please, Dash. I, I wish I didn't say anything. Rainbow. Got we, now we gotta start, obviously, Rainbow Dash did a sonic rain boom. And when Scootaloo said, I wish I didn't say anything, I'm guessing Sonic that sonic rain boom might have caused something. So, but we're gonna see. Celestia, or no, um, Luna, what are we going to do? Cadence, my baby and my husband is out there. What will happen to them? Celestia, I don't really know. It has not been studied that well. Princess Celestia is healthy but stressed. Health is 80%, sanity is 80%, hunger is 15%, thirst is 20%, and she owns her magic. Princess Cadence is healthy, depressed, and stressed. Health is 80%, hunger is 32%, thirst is 20%, sanity is 40%. She owns her magic and a medical first aid kit. Princess Luna is healthy, depressed, and stressed. Health is 70%, sanity is 51%, hunger is 16%, thirst is 20%, and she owns her magic. Moving on. Is this thing on? Oh, yay, yeah, it is. I'm um, high. I, the great powerful Trixie, have figured out some things about this outbreak. Let me see if I can find the paper. Oh, yes, here it is now. Maybe I can bi finally be noticed by the princesses. This is based on one of my test subjects, Rarity. I currently have my magic as of right now, keeping myself safe. But here are some causes and symptoms from this outbreak. Here are some of the causes and symptoms of what can happen when looked at the sky. As of right now, it is night, so I don't really have to worry about much, and I'm trying to stay inside, although my old home got burnt down by a couple other ponies, and I'm currently searching for a shelter. But here, take a look. The symptoms and causes. Suicide attempts worshipping the sky. Cannibalistic er, ac uh, what? Cannibalistic actions, cutting off cutie marks, very aggressive, getting voices in their head, weird deformities. The more they look up at the sky, the more the infection grows. That that's very bird box like. That's very bird box like. I don't know. I guess that could just be me because I believe uh, you just have to see the wind or something in bird box, but you have to look at the sky and it like completely fucks with your mind. That's interesting. This is all I have for now. My research will go on the camera. Rarity is infected at stage two, but she looks fine overall. She just doesn't have a horn. It looks like it was broken in half. Hunger is 70%, thirst is 20%, sanity is 20%, health is 50%, and she owns a butterfly knife and makeup. Moving on. Rarity. Hey, Trixie, did anything happen to Sweetie Belle? Please tell me the truth. Did she survive? Trixie. Rarity. She did not. Rarity. Oh, Celestia. Tw Trixie, she, she, she died under impact. Her body wasn't fully grown to contain the infection side of it. But before she died, she killed her... S her what? Oh, I'm so sorry. Trigger warning, blood. Ah. Bang. Ah, says AJ. What in tarnation? Now, Applejack's looking over, goes to run to it. Rainbow? Ah, get away! No, no, it's okay, it's me. What happened? 
I did a sonic rain boom for Scoop, but I took it too far trying to prove myself as cool to her. And then this. I don't know, it hurts so bad, please help. Okay, just calm down and I will bring you back to the farm. Rainbow Dash is not affected, but it looks like she's missing her limbs. Hunger is 80%, Thirst is 90%, Sanity is 50%, Health is 19%, and she owns nothing. Now we have this, the final video. Do not look up at the sky. I repeat, do not look up at the sky. Due to a mishap of a sonic rainbow accident in Equestria, ponies have been looking up into the sky and going manic, being recalled as doing suicide, major signs of getting sick and throwing up, and or worshipping it. We request you not go outside for a couple months. The princesses are figuring out ways to get rid of this. Please stay inside and if it is required to go outside, keep your eyes on the ground. Do not look up. If you do look up, you are going, you know, you are long gone. If you have managed to go through without any of the symptoms, go to the princess immediately. Thank you. Stay safe and keep up with your loved ones as said before. The princesses are trying to take care of everything and get everyone safe as they can get to the safe spaces immediately. Princess Luna and Princess Celestia. So that's all we got for now when it comes to the MLP Rainbow Apocalypse AU here. And it is fairly unpopular. It doesn't have many views. But the story is pretty nice. I like an idea where you look up at the sky and just looking at the sky there's something up there. That just takes a hold of your mind and completely twists it, making you a deranged, death-defying, evil version of yourself. It's very interesting. The only thing I'm pretty sad about is we didn't really get to see an infected character. Yeah, we saw Rarity, who was infected, but they didn't show much of what it explained they would look like. For example, the deformities. I didn't see any deformities on Rarity, and the only deformity I've seen is Rainbow Dash being an amputee having their legs removed. So that's the only kind of thing I'm seeing. And I'm not saying uh, if you're an amputee, right, you're deformed or anything. I'm saying that's the closest thing we're going to get to that because it shows a difference in character that has to like, how do I explain this properly? I don't know. I'm trying not to be offensive. If I offended you, I do apologize. But basically, right? Um, it was a pretty solid story. It's a little bit slower paced, I'd say. Like, it doesn't go that fast. It kind of doesn't show much of the horror aspect of things, except for when Rainbow Dash hits the ground. Now, overall, I do like the story, and I hope to see more come out. That way we can see what the infected look like, and this and that, and I don't know. We'll figure it out. But anyway, make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed, dislike if you didn't. It is completely fine either way. And that's all I got to say. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.